How's it going, guys? Welcome to the Piggy Bank, uh, your favorite casual gaming podcast with the casual gaming buds. My name is Phil. I'm your host for this lovely show here on the Two Penny Games channel live on Twitch. We can You can catch us live every Monday around 4, sometime in the afternoon every Monday, uh, Central. Um, and then afterwards, it's going to show up on YouTube uh, every Saturday whenever Tavin decides to upload it, you know? Oh, okay, well, hold on, <laughs> hold on. All right, no, 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 no. This week, this last week went up at the right time. It's just something went wrong in the edit, and it wasn't very good. <laughs> so, he fucked oh, it up. And, and that, that, of course, is, is one of my friends here, Tavin. Hello, Hello. what's poppin', players? How we doing today? Uh, and then across the table from him, we have Connor Elliott. Let me just finish my, introducing you guys. Yeah, my uh, legs and feet are riddled with bug bites. Oh, yeah? So, Doing some, uh, see, some outside stuff from work or what? Not even that. I just sat outside one evening, and that was it. I did put yeah. on bug spray, well, anyway. and that was that. Well, maybe you should start anyway. putting on some bug spray. I always try to, but those guys love my blood, so any chance I'm lacking, they come it's in. It's because you're so sweet. It is. because you're so sweet. Tasty Clearly. blood. Um, mm-hmm. Can't concur. Yeah. Yeah, you can check out all of our <laughs> links in the description below on this video if you're watching on YouTube, over on YouTube.com forward slash at two penny games uh make sure to give us a follow on twitter tiktok uh tavin does a great job putting up great tiktoks um you can actually recently check out my top 10 games ever on tiktok um and on youtube shorts so yeah give us a give us a little uh little shout out there yeah it's up there it's a good time our episode 200 of the two penny games cast that we did uh went back did the math connor we're like two weeks away from hitting gear four Damn, really? I know. It, it, we started in July at some point. July 27th, I believe, yeah. is the date. So that it's obviously not going to match up as uh, with uh, launch day or mm-hmm. uh, or uh, mm-hmm. however we call it. the Whatever anniversary. The anniversary day. That's yeah. what it is. Uh, obviously, it's not going to match up. But kind of cool. Yeah. We've been doing this for a little kinda bit. Cool. We have been doing it for a while. First um, mile. What do you call them? Mile markers. Milestone? Milestones. Milestones, yes. Uh, it was anyway, one of those situations where you just uh, can't of, remember something. Shut up. This, of course, is our is our casual gaming podcast where we come together. We talk about our week in gaming, uh, what we've been playing, kind of what we look forward to coming out in the coming week, uh, and we play mini games. We come together. We usually usually discuss gaming trivia or whatever kind of topics we have on our minds. Uh, we kind of gamify those, and uh, we compete to see who is the true epic gamer. It's usually me. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. We don't count. We don't count. No. We don't count. I have no idea. What we don't. The, we we don't keep score. Um, I have no I'm idea. What curious the are. <laughs> of like what the. I'm. I, you know what? I'll. I'll. No. Nah, it's a waste go, of time. Yeah. Go. 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 Run up the fifty something episodes. You know. Yeah. Right. No. Uh, it's more than fifty for sure. I thought you were just gonna say uh, we start now. Better late than never. No. No. Nah. I, I would want. I would want an overarching like list. You know. Nah, fair They're enough. They're not always games. Something- you know, it's sometimes it's just yeah. fun conversations. It's it'd yeah, be weird true. to how how do you count them because like um I do a lot of conversation based things. So you guys have more potential to get numbers up than me. Mm-hmm. Not me. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's true. Yeah, or I guess okay. it would be Well, I mean, if anything, you would have more opportunities to get more numbers up. Yeah. It it'd trades be, off because it's you the don't other fail. way. It's the other way. It's the other way. Yeah. Uh but no, maybe maybe I'll like keep track of that. I'll like start from the beginning and then maybe through time not obviously not in one sitting that's a fucking mm. jesus it's way too long uh long especially with like sometimes we go for a little too long on, yeah. on these episodes uh so it's a long time anyway um boys we've been playing anything fun recently oh boy have i uh i have started i think i mentioned it before but i've started my my journey into final fantasy 7 rebirth hard mode uh, I, I cleared the Crystal Caves last night, and let me tell you, there's a boss at the end of the Crystal Caves uh, who is quite difficult. Took a couple of took a couple of attempts. I had to switch materia around a couple of different times to get the planning and uh, the the tactics right because uh, it just it, it the game forces you to like um, uh, think about boss encounters in a more like full way. And, uh, and, and of course, you know, because they're boss fights, they have, like, different waves to them. So you, of course, have the assess materia, which gives you the breakdown of, like, the enemy is weak to the to these things, not so or resistant to these things. But also, when they do this, you should do this XYZ thing. Um, but it only tells you that for the first 
phase of the fight. Mm. So if the, the boss intro? mutates or changes or has a second phase, you may not necessarily have the information that you may or may not need. So you got to like kind of experiment and, and things so forth. This one, for example, is a rock golem. Um, and it, mm. and it starts off, it's the main body. And then there's a head, uh, that it has when you kill the head that when you, uh, yeah, when you destroy the head, it becomes pressured. You can stagger it, do hell, hella damage to it. Um, but very quickly, not even like a quarter of the way through its health, it enters a second phase and it, and it, um, now grows uh, like a spiky Godzilla spine and like a sword for an arm. Hmm. And the sword for the arm is like used for heavy defense and really big attacks. Uh, but the spike, the spiky spine is the thing that like was tripping me up because like it sends out a bunch of projectiles and stuff. And those will, those dwindled the health uh, of the, the characters I have in the party for that fight. So it's a matter of like, but only destroying the head staggers it. You know, so it's like it's now this like sort of like risk reward of like, all right, what part are you going to destroy? You only have so much uh, mana because you can't get any extra MP back because you can't use items. Um, so you only have so much MP and your characters will die fast. So it's like, OK, well, do you take out the, uh, the arm so that it doesn't it can't defend itself so well do you just attack the head so you can get that pressure gauge up do you take out the spine so that you can be relieved from the projectiles that dwindle your health to fucking nothing cool it's a cool like balance to it so it, it, it it's this example that i'm giving to show that like man these boss fights fucking sing in uh hard mode as opposed to like the, the main game most of the fights not all of them but most of them you can kind of just like heavy attack your way through them mm -hmm. right yeah, i'll be looking forward to that whenever i play uh, my own hard mode of that yeah because yeah the when boss fight when is that happening uh whenever this show allows me to basically. <laughs> and then of course Fair enough. um i'm about to I, I just entered under junon so i'm about to have that fight which was quite difficult yeah oh yeah yeah well now that you're prepared for it Maybe you won't have so much difficulty. Danish Minecraft server Maybe. in the chat. I see you. I see you, but we're just talking. So, you know, we can't, we can't address every, every chat message. Uh, so, yeah. Thanks, thanks for uh, jumping in. Nearly a, nearly a year you following us. Thank you, sir. I appreciate it. Thank you Fair all enough. for all the follows uh, in the chat today. It's you we're kind of viewers in. that boost us up. But the Phil, ones that keep coming back. Phil, mm -hmm. we've been playing a little something something, haven't we? We have. We've been, we started playing Borderlands 2. Yeah. I've, I I uh, I had the itch. Not? I've had the the handsome collection downloaded for a couple of days or weeks or something like that. And uh, I hit Phil up one night. I said, "Hey man, the itch is here. I'm gonna do it. You you in?" He jumped in. I, I tried to get you, but you were busy prepping for the Shadow of the Earth Tree review, so you were like, "Ah, I'll, I'll have to take a pass." And uh, man, that game's fun. It is fun. It's a very fun game. Um, I like that game a it's lot. It's definitely like thinking back to like when whenever we used to play uh, three. Uh, together like yeah. uh, on pc that game that game i've said it multiple times that's like the peak of the borderland series in terms of like gameplay it's yeah the best feeling game to play uh so there's some like quality of life improvements in that game that we're definitely missing from two like there's no uh clamber like there's no like grabbing on a ledge like ledge grab you know yeah um, there's no slide or anything like that yeah. um it just that and i i felt the the I, I can't remember in detail because it's been a minute since I played Borderlands 3, but I, I remember the skill tree being a little bit more flexible. Um, yes. So well. in, in 3, um, it just, the little, because like you, you gain access to skill points basically like top down. Yeah. Uh, so in 3, you can go to whatever part of the tree you want, and as long as you're spending skill points, a little like, it's almost like a bar, like that'll fill kind of to where you can go down further on the other parts of the skill tree whereas in two if it only it only fills for that side of the skill tree that you're on yeah so you'll have um, you'll so have like, three skill trees that specialize in different things depending on your class um and in before three it was like you have to dump points into one specific skill tree to get to the more powerful upgrades but in three they unlocked it or they they had it to where that progression lasts across the board across all three skill trees so if yeah. i there it's a it's like a what is it a blue green and red if i if yeah. i put points in green i can't i'm not making progress in the red tree in two but in three no matter where I put them, I can make progress and I can go and grab the other upgrades uh, from the other trees if I want. Which is really nice because, like, sure, some of the stat-based upgrades are useful 
Um, but you're there for like the kills, kills, or the the passives, or right, um, yeah. the 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 newer abilities, like or things that the affect, things that, like may, maybe modify your like your uh, your big uh, active ability that you yeah. can activate. You know, yeah, things like that. So it's 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 a bit of a grind in the early bits of two because it's like, well, I, there's so many great skills deeper in the skill trees, but like I've got I've got to get. Uh, this one that's in this skill tree, and I've got to get this one that's in the other one. So I'm having to sort of delineate focus per skill tree and not getting what I want right away. Um, so, you know, so just another thing that th they continued to evolve that series in small ways that improved the quality of life so much, like Phil was saying. But the writing in 2 is so much better than the than any other game in the franchise like it is genuinely funny i'm not like paying hard attention to the narrative or the story or the thing that's happening in it just because you know it's it's a co-op game you're running around you're shooting shit you're you're digging in your menus and all this it, it's a little you're hard to focus like on talking a, to your friend yeah you're mostly talking to your friend it's a little hard to focus on the story um so but when i do cue into what they're talking about i'm chuckling i'm laughing the whole like ev every few minutes it's one of those where they're just going to hit you constantly with these jokes and not all of them are going to la land but the ones that do are really really funny Whereas in three, they would do this kind of thing, but we'd just be rolling our eyes and sighing. And yeah, it was just really just poorly written and, and annoying. It was just annoying. They lost themselves in the uh, writing department, at least from that one. Well, it, it proved in I, the. In I the next can't remember game. exactly how many, but it was something like six writers on Borderlands three, and that's well, just you, too many. Well, you do need a lot of writers in video games, especially of ones of this size. Like one writer isn't writing the dialogue for every side quest, mm. you know. Um, right, but it's usually like anywhere between like th maybe three. You know, I think three. I, I can't remember exactly how many. That that may be for like main narrative like. stuff, but I yeah, there's there's always a bunch of writers in the room, uh, for for smaller stuff. Or or it'll pair off and be like, hey Connor, go do all the side quests for this region. I'll do all the side quests for that region, so on and so forth. Um, but yeah, there's definitely like in in three. I just think I I think they got new writers and they they didn't understand. Yeah. Uh, okay. popular culture at that time so it just didn't hit right i think that's 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 what, what i was thinking because nope. um i don't know if y'all you, you guys know uh, ashley birch she's the voice actress for uh aloy yes and uh, uh, tiny, tiny tina, tina. Yeah, yeah so her brother was actually the writer the head like story writer for borderlands 2 and they had a show that i used to watch called hey ash what you playing uh quality quality old show i don't know if y'all ever watched that I've, I'd seen a video or two in the past, but I, I can't remember anything about it. Yeah. Quality. Uh, it was that, one of those, uh, I can't remember the, the name of the the company. I think it was Cinemassacre. I think they were part of that. <laughs> oh, Cinemassacre. Couldn't tell you. Ashley Birch, an actor who, like, just let her go and be highly energetic and charismatic and so forth. Because in Aloy and in her Life is Strange character, which I can't recall which one she played um oh i know it's fucking the one that i hate uh chloe no chloe, not chloe yeah. is it chloe or the other one chloe, max chloe it's chloe all right she's, she's both chloe. of those i'm like oh she's really flat in this i'm not i'm not into what she's doing but you you listen to her as tiny tina um and then you listen to her as aloy in the lego game and you go oh this is super fun mm. i like what she's doing here so like she's just one of those it's just like just let her be energetic and and ha like kind of happy and crazy and and um quirky quirky yeah she she just fits that mold so much better when she's super serious and it, 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 just all of her charisma kind of goes out the window hmm. which is unfortunate because she's super she's charismatic in, when she's in those like super charismatic quirky roles it like when that character does get serious it kind of hits harder yeah because like there, there's moments especially in um i think it's a sultan dragon keep where like tiny tina has to like really uh grapple with the fact that Roland is dead and Roland is essentially like her father figure. Um, mm. And she like, she has like a really reserved part. Don't, of, uh, do, it, but of, don't of get that. me wrong. I've seen that. I'm not saying she can't carry or hold water in dramatic scenes or in, in more serious scenes. Of course she can, but it, it it's just when it's surrounded by that same tone, uh, it comes off flat. So like it, it, it's, I, it might just be a direction thing. Um, you know, I'd have to see her in other things that aren't video games because video games are 
complicated for voice actors because like where is the player at in the story what have they done what have they not done you can't get all the nuances across as an actor that you would probably like um especially in a game like uh life is strange or like horizon where the character has different dialogue options it, it just makes everything mm-hmm. more difficult and more um complicated absolutely absolutely mm-hmm. right connor you've been playing anything other than Erdtree? uh n- probably but by the time we're recording this episode i've only played shadow of the earth tree uh did i beat it no <laughs> did i beat it by the time you're listening to this maybe uh have i played pretty much the entire dlc yes and you can listen to our review that came out earlier in the week it released back on tuesday me and phil uh tavin he's an elder ring hater just uh, self-described Elden ring hater he Whoa. told me beforehand uh we were on some other tangent that it was a mortal sin in the gaming community that it beat God of War 20. Uh, that's not what I, hey, that's not how that conversation and, and, went, you and, son of a bitch. That's not how that conversation am, went at all. I'm saying it is. You know, you added, you added that. That was you. That was not me at all. You you put that on me. You put words in say, my mouth. I Nevertheless. Don't, I, don't think, I don't think Tavin, I don't think I've ever heard Tavin say the words mortal sin. <laughs> <laughs> I gave it away, huh? Damn. Um, no, and it's wild that you're calling me a hater. I have the game installed. I've been playing it. I'm like 20 hours deep into a campaign right now. Um, <laughs> But it's easy to say you're a hater. It's I got into the I got into the uh, the whatever they call it the 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 magic university the magic college Leia, Raya, Raya Lucaria. Lucaria yeah Raya that, Lucaria. that 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 joint I got into there it's difficult in there <laughs> it's yeah it's, people are people are throwing throwing lots of spells stone shards yeah a lot of, a lot of spells going on a lot of things you got to dodge and keep in but mind and you use spells I do use spells so I'm using it against them and it's <laughs> How does working it feel? it's working very well <laughs> you know uh so yeah that, you know that's that's where I'm at in that making very slow progress but I'm just you know I, I mean it's a game where it's like Pick no, it up every now and then. You know, you just kind of like you just kind of paint. I like how they do the maps in that game. Well, I I do and I don't. I like that it's like you're like uncovering parts of the map and so forth. Um, I don't love how easy it is to miss where the maps are because they're. I mean, they're usually like inside of a point of interest, so they're not like hard to find. Um, but you know, it, th- there was one area that I like cleared the whole area out and went where the fuck is the map? And then it was in like this one spot that I just glazed over well if you go into each and every area you'll even if you haven't unlocked the map there you'll see like a little totem every single time that's where the map is so it marks it out for each region so if I, was ever, gonna, I was about to say that i was gonna yeah. say correct me if i'm wrong but i'm pretty sure even if you open the map you can see where because i know it does that like actually it, fill out the map. it does that mm-hmm. for places of interest so like if you enter a town or uh one of the the telescopes that let you see up or whatever or you know anything like that then yeah it'll put it'll put a marker there but i i'm not i don't know what this totem is that you're talking it's about. a small it's, thing it's it's almost like someone so you know how when you open the map and you haven't discovered what the actual map is yeah yeah, yeah. like it's just like a brown it almost looks like like a brown map that someone hasn't like marked yet yeah, there's like yeah. a little, there's like a little, almost like a drawing of like a little lighthouse, almost that someone like it just looks like someone drew a little lighthouse on the map. It, that is where the map actually is. It, uh, the best way to describe it is it's a little stone tablet into the ground, just like where you find the maps. They're mm-hmm. always in those like yeah, yeah, markers. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'll look again. I'll look again this uh, mm-hmm. this next time though. Makes it way yeah, easier. It's not even, yeah. It's not even like a totem like that. Like yeah. how all the places of interest are on the map. It's it's like a like a little drawing. Basically, that's what it looks like. Okay. Yeah. But I do like how it fills out the map. Yeah. It, it, yes. it, it feels good. Yeah. It, it feels good to pick up a map and look at it and go, oh, look at all this, all these areas to, mm-hmm. to see and, and explore and stuff like that. So it was, I just remember whenever I first started playing, I was like, man, this is a pretty big map. And then I, <laughs> I got to the next map. I was like, man, this is a really big map. And then it gets just get, it keeps getting bigger and bigger and bigger. It's like, holy shit. <laughs> so, like, because you can zoom out and see everything. Is it like intentionally constricting how much I can zoom out, and it's going to allow yes. me to zoom out even more? Okay. Yes. Yeah. Okay. All right. Because people always talked about they were like, "Oh man, there's a moment where like the map blows up," and I'm like, "Well, I'm like zooming out all the way, and yeah, there's a lot of space left so to like fill out." But like, I'm sitting there, I'm like, "This is about an average open world map size, mm-hmm. you know? Like it's a big one, but it's about average. There's nothing I haven't seen before." Uh, so like, I, yeah, I was wondering if they were intentionally restricting on how how much i can zoom out yeah and there's all the under uh, underground areas too that's hard to factor yeah, i haven't been like, in there's any a bunch of yet. like tunnels and shit like that yeah 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 yeah, yeah. so but yeah Elden ring is fun 
It's hard. Elden Ring is mm-hmm. fun. Uh, I think probably the the biggest Elden Ring enjoyer here, Connor. Uh, what mini game do you have? Oh, sorry. Fuck. I'm so stupid. Damn. I'm sorry. Man. I'm going first this this week. There we go. Uh, because what I've been playing, I, I I was playing a lot of Kingdom Hearts three, and I platinumed it. Uh, yeah, and that that platinum is kind of a bitch. And uh, you know, <laughs> talking about Kingdom Hearts, that leads into my mini game. Uh, you guys know how much I love Kingdom Hearts 2. Uh, so today we're going to play a higher or lower game oh. uh, for IGN scores on each of the individual Kingdom Hearts games. Hmm. And to kind of help you guys, uh, I have uh, looked into a bunch of gameplay videos for each of the Kingdom Hearts games. So y'all can kind of look at these and judge uh, kind of where you might think they ended up just by like looking at gameplay um, just to try to help you. Uh, because I know that Connor has really only played like three or four of the games. Tavin, you've only played two of them. Um, so just to kind of help you guys out on uh, where they score. So um, I, I I do think I will tell you what score IGN gave Kingdom Hearts to. See if that helps. Um, but I will only give you that information for Kingdom Hearts 2. And I will not... Uh, tell you the scores for each of the other ones because i don't want to give you too many hints because it's like oh there's no way that many games are, are like to this po- this level you know um connor you had a question yeah so what's the general main way we're getting points we're trying to guess the ranking that's going to get or the if it's higher or lower than kingdom Hearts 2 oh uh, so, yeah, okay two is the is the control group yes and that, that we're basing everything off of correct that is okay, correct, okay. um so I'll, I'll go ahead and just uh I'll, i'm gonna go in release order Okay. Um, Kingdom Hearts 2 for IGN scored a 7.6. Appropriate. Damn. Okay. Uh, so, in release order, the first Speed game eight. on the list, of course, is Kingdom Hearts 1. So, this is, you know, got some, some Traverse Town going on here. Uh, mm-hmm. If y'all can tell me whether this, uh, this scored higher or lower than Kingdom Hearts 2. This is KH1. That is correct. Do you have footage of KH2 that we can look at just so that we can... No, I did not pull that up, but yeah, I mean, well, that's, that's, I can. would have been, yeah, we, we need a control group, Phil. But you uh, guys have played Kingdom Hearts 2. Yeah, I know what to expect. Yeah, but maybe the audience needs to see something, Phil. Well, <sighs> while he's pulling that up, yeah. with Kingdom Hearts 1, uh, a trend we find with older games, more 90s games, but also 2000, early 2000 games like this one, the score will be higher than you think it is. Or more particularly, it'll be higher than games that came out later. I guess because the standards were different at the time. So you'll find games that might not be rated like a, a 90, but it is. And you'll find games that are, you know, sometimes objectively better or at least more marketable that are ro- uh, rated lower because that's just how things work out. Ein Kuhn in the chat, thank you for speaking out for me, Tav, and love you. See? People need to know. And also, I don't really remember the difference between one and two. Visually. Fake fan. Wow. Yeah, two looks a lot better. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. You, it, it's framed in the same way, but when you look at both of them, oh, yeah, fuck. it's night and day. He's dragging that's tabs three. around. He's mm-hmm. dragging tabs. There, there we go. That's I mean, two. That's not three. That's two. I don't know. Two. Okay. Two. Okay. One. So one. Yeah. Two. Yeah. Th- even with what I was just saying, it has to be lower. I mean, it should be lower. It should but be. But the thing about new IPs, Connor, is sometimes new IPs get get boost artificially boosted um, than what they probably should, just because they're new. Yeah, you know, your first your first impression of things are, are very often your your like most favorable favorable version of that. You know, that's why like Arkham Asylum is still held up to to that degree, even though there were games after it that clearly were better than that. That's true. Um. I just All think that, it's criminal that IGN thinks that 2 is a 7.6. No, that's appropriate. It, um, it needs to be an 8. It needs to be in the 8s for sure. Yeah. This, this I, can be in the 7s. I seven. think like a 7.5 seven, is fine. 7, like a hard 7, yeah, that's a little low maybe, but yeah, a 7.5 is fine. Well, and also these are all just opinions, so you know, you, you, gotta, you gotta put a little wiggle room on it. Yeah, but this game's peak though. Like, mm. look, look at this. It's a very fun game, yes. I wouldn't call it peak. Oh, it um, peak. <laughs> I mean, I mean, here's the thing: two should be higher. It really should be higher. 
I would be like I I would be shocked if one is higher, but I'm gonna go ahead and say one is in fact higher. It shouldn't be, but I'm gonna say it because I think well I think people Tevin, think, think that way or another. Connor, are you saying anything? What did you say? Con- well, lower. Connor said lower. lower. Okay. Kingdom Hearts one is higher. Yeah. Ooh. How much higher? Uh, I'm not gonna tell you that. Oh. Uh-huh. I told you that. I told you I wasn't gonna tell you that. <laughs> yes, you did say that. Well, we'll find out eventually. Alyssa we, Raven, we might, yo, what's might. up? Saying hi in the chat. What is up? All right, what's the next uh, one? Next game on the list, Kingdom Hearts Rechain of Memories. This is that this is that goofy, weird card one where you have a inventory of cards as your weapon. Indeed. Jesus Christ, it looks exactly like Kingdom Hearts one. Um just just because he's in he's in the same outfit. Oh, but it had like repetitive uh it had like repetitive environments and stuff in this one too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Battle we, of the we, boss we had watched Phil play this while I was playing yeah. two. Um one or two, whichever one of them. Um This was originally a uh Game Boy Advance game. This is a re release on PS two. Are you using the the PS two review or the PS the Game Boy? Well review? this this is no the Game Boy is like a fucking it looks like a... It's like yeah, the foot the footage. Feet. Which review are you using? This is PlayStation, dude. Come on. See, I'm guessing the original was called Chain of Memories, and this one's Re this, this Chain of Re Memories. Chain of Memories. Yeah. That's correct. Um, I'm still gonna go with lower. I don't yeah, know. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go lower. Yeah, I can't. I can't imagine this is higher. I can't either. Even though, like, fans like this game well enough, mm-hmm. you know, but. Surely not higher than Kingdom Hearts 2. Well, you're both incorrect. Damn. Oh, this wow. Is rated higher than Kingdom Hearts 2. Very strange. You know, things with sequels gets complicated, you know? Yeah, I guess. I mean, the it's first one unique. made sense, even though it's wrong. Even though it's wrong. Even, I, I think this everybody one. universally across the board agrees 2 is way better than they say every the, other game in the yeah. franchise. I mean, just, but, just look at... It's like night and day, dude. I guess not. It's really... I mean, like... No, it is better. <laughs> you, you just look at the smoothness of the animations. and the... Got, We got Winnie the Pooh? Yeah. Winnie the Pooh? Just kidding. I like how Sora uh, is frozen in his frame there. <laughs> well, that's, that's, how they, that's how they did in the PlayStation 2 days, you know? Uh, of Kingdom Hearts. I should, I oh, okay, 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 like, okay. Of gonna, Kingdom Hearts is what I what I'm, I was, was going to say, like, mm. there's a lot of ratchet and... Let me, uh, and, uh, I want to I wanna get to... There's, like, a really goofy face that Sora makes. In Chain of Memories, I just want to get to it. Damn dog, the dow. Oh, that was it. Hang on, look at his face. He's like, ooh, he's a card. <laughs> I didn't see it. Static Sorry. face. I love the static face. Well, I'll make sure to get that toy away from her. It remind. No, it's fine. No, that's fine. Whatever. All right. Next on the list, uh, Tavin, you mind keep if you don't mind keeping score. Uh, that is one. You have one point, and then uh, Connor yeah, I'm up one. Out. I'm up one. Cool, cool. Uh, next game, we have Kingdom Hearts 358 over two days. Okay. No, okay. There's no way. Here's this is the for thing: the, the the Nintendo DS. Yeah. Mm. You know. Okay, but like, all right, yeah, you're in that in that era. Nintendo DS is early, so in that era, you got extra points for just being a functional game on the DS. Yeah. Com- compared to a, a console counterpart. In addition to that, this does have a good story, which is the main pull of it. But I don't. No, I, I refuse to believe that. People, love, it is. People love Roxas. <laughs> it doesn't get it into the. Uh, story. It doesn't get into the, like the more complicated. Like people think, but, but stuff. there are people who say one and two have good stories. Yeah, but the don't. general standard is that it's difficult to follow along and it's a little bit basic. This is one I've almost always heard just good things about. Mm. With those other ones, there's always a grain of salt. But you know, I played this and the narrative was getting me through it. But unfortunately, the gameplay just isn't there and so i have to say higher he's going higher yeah just because the ds part you made point you made yeah is pretty reasonable yeah i think i think there was a lot of i think there was a lot of talk of like hey for for transferring a console game over to a handheld with no analog sticks and and you know less buttons this is pretty good Mm -hmm. you know so yeah i'm gonna say higher you're both correct yep it is Get it higher. Uh, I'm almost certain it's because they're 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 just impressed that a Kingdom Hearts game is playable <laughs> on a DS. All right. 
Moving when I on. played it, I played it with the 3DS, so I had the little analog stick thing. What if what if all of this was to lead into the fact that Kingdom Hearts 2 is the lowest rated game in the entire franchise by IGN? That would be, that would <laughs> be, be pretty crazy, funny. wouldn't it? That would be fucking nuts! Uh, next up, we have Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep. I noticed he didn't do the he didn't do the the little uh, the phone game. Phone game? Uh, yeah. I'm going in release order, Tavin. We're not there yet. Oh nope. my god! I thought that came out like right after Kingdom Hearts one. Uh, I'm gonna see at the bat bat. Can I ask? Though, can I ask which phone game you're asking? The like shitty two D one that played on a flip phone that you can't you can't even play oh, it anymore. No. That one, I'm I'm doing I'm pulling from the the DS uh, remake of that one. That, that oh, one's oh, okay. Like Chain of Memories, because that one that one's called Kingdom Hearts Coded. Uh, the one that the one that I'm pulling from is called Recoded. Oh, okay. So the release date of Recoded, as opposed to the okay. Gotcha, right. gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. When you go for as long as a period for not making your third game like Kingdom Hearts, might as well just do a bunch of different fucking ports, and you know, conversions. Yeah, we've this got franchise Kingdom Hearts so Birth garbage. by Sleep here. <laughs> uh, this is higher, though. I, uh, if, if, uh, fucking, I just forgot. Uh, 358 by two days is higher. This has to be. Because, once again, I've only heard great things about this one. What the hell am I looking at? Look at that. There you go. That is a shot lock, is what you were looking at. I think it's lower. I don't think people like playing as Roxas. You're not Roxas. This isn't Roxas, Roxas. It's Ventus. I don't think people like playing <laughs> XYZ character, not Sora. Look at this guy. And he says the story is bad. He can't even name characters. He doesn't know what he's talking you got, about. You got Terra, Aqua, and Vence, Ventus here. Town in fairness. I'm going to say lower. I, I, don't, I, I think people are like, yeah, this is fun, but I miss Sora. Connor, and you said higher? They could. But yeah, <laughs> I'm going to say higher. I think game reviews are, this, are that dumb. Uh, it is higher. Oh, oh, tie game. Tie game. Yeah, yeah, yes. Uh, I need it then. This is, dude. Birth by Sleep is fucking amazing. Uh, Tavin, the reason that Ventus looks like Roxas, or rather that Roxas looks like Ventus, because this is a prequel, um, is because Ventus, his heart got split, and part, his, the light side was in Sora, and so that's why Sora's nobody, when he became a heartless, his nobody looks like Ventus. So he, he looks like Roxas. You're giving the look at the camera. This is very easy to know stuff. This isn't even the, like, you have a lot of criticisms to make of Kingdom Hearts stared. No, I can criticize this. No, you can't. I can criticize you this. You don't even know who the listen, guy is. Listen, you don't even know who listen, he is. Stupid is stupid. It doesn't matter how simple it is. Stupid is stupid. And it's stupid. No, it's not stupid at all. That's and you stupid. Like, stupid calling Ventus Roxas. You have, a, you dummy. played, yeah, I mean, you played Kingdom Hearts 2. There's, when someone becomes a Heartless, there's also a nobody. Oh, this ever. one spiky hair blonde guy is different than the other spiky hair blonde He's guy, all, even though they're the same guy. They are not the same guy, and as a matter of they're, fact, that's like making the differential different. between, that's like making the differential between in episode three of Anakin Skywalker there and Darth is. Vader. It's still Anakin Skywalker. Take, no, this is different. This is a different he doesn't get. He doesn't become Darth himself. Vader until he, until he's in the suit. I mean, there he is. That guy is clearly different than <laughs> this guy. Well, it's, it's the same fucking guy. Different. It's no, different. The same different. Fucking different. Guy. Different. Clearly, it's different. Clearly different. Just not that different. Dude, I even thought the I thought the, the hair was they, styled they differently. It's, because the reason yeah, I, I thought so too. I thought the hair was styled like dramatically different. No, it's about the same. And I thought he was gonna have a different <laughs> no, shade of hair too. Yeah, it's the, the same, same character. <laughs> the eye color. There's nothing different between these two. I'm pretty no, sure that's how, that's how he looks. It's literally at the, end the same of, for the reason I told you. I hate this franchise. <laughs> nobody. He's a nobody. Ah, listen, Tavin. A lot of people have considered this the best Kingdom Hearts game. Not uh, most voiced, but voiced by Jesse McCartney. Really? Yeah, the, uh, the 2000s heartthrob, yeah. How'd they get... Uh, okay, sure. Why not? <sighs> Disney, man. They, yeah. they got money. Yeah, yeah. Easy. Yeah, you can have our characters put our actors in it, you know? Yeah. They're like, all right, um, <laughs> do you want to read the script? No, I'm sure it's fine. It's not. <laughs> <laughs> they couldn't get I Danny believe. DeVito, though. So They could not get Danny DeVito. It's true. Failure uh, on their part there. We've got we've got 1-1. One, one. Is that correct? Yes. 2-2, two, two, but yeah. Two, two. Oh, oh well, two, two? Yeah, okay, yeah right. that, it's a tie two, game. It doesn't matter. Might as right. well be at Next zero. Up, yeah. <laughs> we've got Kingdom Hearts Dream Drop Distance. Okay. Now, this is the one that's, like, panned, right? This is the one that nobody likes. Uh, I don't know. I'm not going to say anything. What's the one nobody likes? Because I thought it was 352 over whatever. It is not that one, I 358 over two. Uh, and and I, I, can't, I, I, can't, I can't give my input on this. Yeah, it'd be too much uh, giving away the I game. It'd be too much of a clue. 
Give me some gameplay here, Phil. Because yeah, yeah, you remember right now? what was this on? It's about to get slow motion. Uh, the 3DS. You may want to. This skip is ahead the PS4. This is the PS4 version, but this is originally on 3DS. You can get it in the uh, collection that has one, two. It does have the one big, no, the big one. It's not in that one. It's in the collection that has uh, uh, this game, uh, 2.8 Final Chapter Prologue, and the movie for. So, uh, so if I just play, if I play the Super Collection that's available on PS4 uh, and Kingdom Hearts 3, I can get the entire everything story, yes? Well, so there's two, two collections on PS4. That confused me, too. I forgot about that. I hate Square Enix. <laughs> um, Damn. This is the flow, this this cool. is slow motion from That's uh, cool. introduced in, in Dream Drop Distance. It's very cool. I appreciate and hate that they didn't change Travers <laughs> Can you go to the uh, combat though? Yeah. Let me yeah, let me see some let me see some action action. Takes a second. Jesus takes a second. Yeah, well, yeah, he's doing the five second skips. Oh, you, got, you got you got this guy uh, from The World Ends With You. That is true. See, I'm not mad about presentation of of dialogue and cutscenes because it's 3ds, so it's it looks exactly how Kingdom Hearts would look. <laughs> um, all right, just for getting around, you can also use it in combat. Jesus, uh, he just pulled up the tutorial. There we go. Okay, there we go. All right, all right. So, what do we do? Oh, that's kind of cool. Oh, you see, this is cool. I can see how that's fun. But it's a matter of whether it's rated lower or higher. Dream adopted. It's, uh, uh, it's I don't know. It's higher. Fuck. All yeah. these games look the fucking same. It's higher. I know it's higher. It is indeed higher. Oh, wow. Yeah, I was waiting for us. you to do your bit because yeah. if you said lower, I knew I would have won. But not here. Right. <laughs> we're and not going to swap got, it. You really want to do that, huh? Recoded. Recoded. Lower. I refuse to believe this is higher. It, Recoded I, was the, the phone one that they... That they put for the DS. Yeah. They got fucking Waka in there, huh? Damn, well, Waka was in the this first has game. To be, this has to be. Lower, oh, he was. Right? This has to be. I mean, like, when you say DS game, this is what I think of. So, like, the last DS game that we had, the first DS game we had, rather, like, looked impressive for a DS game. Now, I don't know if that was because it was on some, like, PS4 shit, but this looks rough. I mean, it is seems like it's more of a puzzle game. So oh, does, Jesus. Does change things what? up. The this, hell is, is this, this? this is an ability menu. Hang on. There was something need inside get, the block. Oh, okay. Oh, no, 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 no. This is the one we watched. Yeah, okay. Yeah, because you do the little hit once. Yeah, I'm going to go lower. Yeah. These, are, these are called bugs. They're like viruses. Because mm. you're inside of a digitized version of Jiminy's journal. Oh, that's why it looks all digitized, mm. Connor. Because you're in a digital thing. Uh, like not, a video not, game. Not because, the, not because the, the hardware can only do so much. <laughs> Tavin the Classic Hater. This had to be a game. I, I can just feel it now. This is a game you control the camera with the bumpers or the like <laughs> or the face buttons or something. You're absolutely correct because if you remember, the original DS did not have a, uh, a like analog a, stick, like a control stick. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I'm well, going lower. Yep. Copier. Uh, I said it for we're both incorrect. Oh wow. Uh, okay. Recoded Wait, does that mean that every has everything been higher? What's been yes. lower? Yes. No. What was lower? Oh shit! Everything has been higher. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> um, but peak, you know, peak. Yeah, Rumble Kingdom. Look, just look at it. Very. Sh Even so, Phil, I'm not like I'm not being a hater. This looks like, other than the last game, all of these have looked exactly the same. Oh god, it, it's so much smoother in the animations. <laughs> Three fifty-eight by two days did not look the same. Also, IGN has changed their grading scale a lot. They don't do the they don't do the the fifty point scale anymore. So this was seven point six, but now they just do twenty points. So it's either a zero or a five. So like when we get to like a Kingdom Hearts three, if it's a seven five, that's the exact same in my mind as a seven six mm -hmm. because they just didn't have the the numbers to play with anymore. You know what I mean? Yeah, I don't know if it'll be that close though. I don't know when they changed that grading system. Mm -hmm. Moving on. We've got Kingdom Hearts Union Cross, which is the uh, mobile slash browser game. There is no way. Okay, this might be higher. Uh, I refuse to believe it. No, it's lower. I refuse. How many more games do we have, Phil? Yeah, I mean, you can count uh, the tabs. There's three oh, more. Three more. You After know, this one, yeah, there's three more. Let's go with something. Some has to be lower, Connor. It's got to be this one. I know, but I'm going to say higher. I'm going to take the plunge on this one. Sephiroth. Yeah. 
I mean, it's not like it's demanding so, the same kind of stuff. Sephiroth's stuff. in it. It's got to be higher. Hey, first thing that popped up, yeah. Sephiroth's in two. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're... Uh, Just waiting on you now, Phil. Oh, did you guys both say higher? N- no, I no. said lower. Uh, Connor said higher. Oh, well... Unfortunately, Connor, it is it is lower than yeah, the one I chose. Yeah, back the in the lead, chose, baby. Of, are you out of your mind? Yeah. Oh, yeah. You, we just saw multiple so games. Like every that other game has been worse. higher. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> anyway. KH2, just not that good. I guess Don't not. To tell you, it's just not that good. We've got Kingdom Hearts 2.8 Final Chapter Prologue. Oh, fucking shit, man. Okay. This was the... Was this like the demo game? No, there was... A, it, this is a Kingdom Hearts 3 tech demo, essentially. Yeah, okay. that's what I thought. Into the, the realm of darkness. In, hmm. I played this. Now, again, if it's 7-5, it's, it's exactly the same, yeah. <laughs> you know? You played this? Yeah, I did. God, I played it before I did play 3. This. this is dumb. Um, Looks a lot prettier, though. It, it's Hunter, based you, off you played this? Yeah, before three came out, like because it got announced, and oh. I was like, "Oh well." It's free to play, in. wasn't it? Hmm? Wasn't it a free download? I don't think so. Oh. I don't. It was not. I think it came with a bundle, didn't it? How long is it? It did come in the bundle. It's like four hours long. It got packaged with Final Fantasy fifteen. No. No, no. It got bundled with like the Kingdom Hearts one, one point. 2.8, 1.8, 2. What do they call it? What's the fucking second? Oh, okay, so the first one is one, 1. 1.5 and 2.5 remix. That's that's yeah. that one, and then this one is from the 2.8 tra- final chapter prologue yes. bundle, which that's is which has this game, Dream Drop Distance, and um, I think the the movie for Recoded, <laughs> if I'm not mistaken. Oh no no, it's it's the um, the movie for Union Cross, and then like a special, um, like a special movie. That's like, it's like an actual like movie that they made, made by people that make uh, video game cutscenes. Mm. So, I'm gonna go lower. Um, I think people were fed up with the bullshit. They just wanted three. They might have. I also remember. I I feel like I remember the reviews to this one, and I remember them being like, not the most negative thing in the world, but I don't remember them being like glowing. Yeah, neither do I. But. I mean, we're comparing it to two, which has been lower that's than that's lower than everything. Yeah. <laughs> so makes it complicated once again. Uh, I piggybacked off Tavin last time. Yeah. But problem is, is I'm not no, feeling you, a no, strong you desire. You, you were wrong. I mean, no, no, no. I piggy, but I, I don't want to piggyback off Tavin. So I'm gonna go. Uh, I'm gonna go with lower. Yeah, I'm just gonna go with lower. Both I, lower. I can't be not. Uh, it is indeed lower okay. than yeah. Kingdom Hearts 2. As it as it probably should be. Looks pretty though. Um it is it is a very good looking game. Uh next we have Kingdom Hearts 3. <laughs> <laughs> Lego Sora is awesome. <laughs> or Bionicle Sora, I guess, is more accurate. Just an action figure, yeah, yeah. Uh Kingdom Hearts 3, again, this is t- this is tricky. I think I, I feel like I've seen the score compared compared to two before. There's no way IGN gave KH three and eight, right? There's no way. No, they easily might have. Because it's like I'm try- and it's core, not a bad game. Uh just because they're standards at that point, I think we're Phil, it's not the longest video in the world. Just <laughs> use just 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 use your use your mouse. I'm gonna go with higher. Um, I don't think it is, of course, but I feel like the game does so much stuff that modern reviewers would give it higher than how two was done back in the day. This was a cool scene. Yeah, they may have they may have undercut two because oh, it wasn't as memorable as the first or whatever, something like that. Yeah. Whatever, whatever uh, the argument was, it wasn't a good one. It wasn't a good one. No, I'll go higher. Piggybacker. Yeah. <laughs> Kingdom Hearts three is indeed higher. Oh, yeah. look at us. Look at us. Look at us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then last but not least, we have Kingdom Hearts <laughs> Melody of Memory, which is a uh, rhythm, rhythm game. game. Jesus Christ. It's a uh, it's basically I think it's I believe it's uh Theat Rhythm, which is the Final Fantasy rhythm game series, but Huh. 
No, I'm going. I'm going lower. <laughs> I, I refuse. I refuse to believe. Either I go the same as you and lose, or go higher than you. At this point, at this point, everybody is sick of Kingdom Hearts. Like, and, and they're bullshit. Everyone's like, "This is bullshit." Like, no, we're not. Maybe we're not putting up with this anymore. I mean, I would agree with you, but I'm gonna try and tie it and go higher. I'm not sick of it. <laughs> you never will be. No. God, you uh, should so be. You Have both, some you, self-respect. You both said, one of you said lower. One of you said higher. I said higher. Yep, I went lower. It is indeed lower than oh, Kingdom Hearts. Mm-hmm. God, see you, Connor. Yep, I was already lost. Eat that dust. Eat that dust. That's and that up. is that is the final game of the of the round. Uh, so finishing right up uh i'm gonna go ahead and stop sharing my screen and i'll, I'll run i'll run you through all the ratings and everything mm-hmm. some of these games are gonna have ridiculously high ratings i'm waiting for it there it is all right and here we are from i'll go i'll go uh bottom bottom to top i'm tired of disney and two and general two line coon no, kingdom Disney's hearts great. union cross is at the bottom because it did not get rated by IGN. Mm. Well, that would do it. <laughs> so the first one, the first one that was like, "Nah, this one's lower." Is it's lower. It wasn't rated. And what if the uh, rhythm game also wasn't rated? I, 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 w- I I'd believe it. Yeah, I would believe. Well, Kingdom it. Hearts Melody of Memory is a seven. Ah, oh, sure. The next sure. one. Up. Then we have Kingdom Hearts two point eight, which is the the tech demo for three. Uh, seven point five again. Only on a twenty-point scale, though, so that's that is right even with Kingdom Hearts two. Mm-hmm. That is equivalent. Those two games are equivalent. You're wrong. Kingdom Hearts two <laughs> seven point six. Then we have wow. a, a three-way tie huh. for uh, for an eight-point uh, ra- rating for Chain of Memories, uh, three hundred fifty-eight over two days, and uh, recoded. Tough. Tough. They were just throwing darts at a board, weren't Kingdom they? Kingdom Hearts 2, third worst uh, uh, Kingdom Hearts game. You know? Objectively. Objectively. Mm-hmm. Well, <laughs> As per IGN. Tavin, <sighs> Tavin, guess what? You said third worst. That would make Because that's a three-way tie, that would make it the fourth worst. So you're already wrong. But you're even more wrong because there's Phil, still... Phil, still I, said more worst, I said worst, not best. So you're going the wrong direction. So you got to go bottom up. So there are two games underneath Kingdom Hearts 2. I mean, I didn't include the Remind DLC, which for some reason they, they made separate. So, you know. <laughs> well, of course. You got to review your DLCs. You got to review the DLCs. Mm-hmm. The, the Remind DLC actually got a six, which I think is crazy. Um, <laughs> is that a bat? Like, it's too high or too low? It's too low. The Remind yeah. DLC was great. Hmm. Uh, what was the Remind DLC for? Three? Three, yeah. Yeah. Couldn't tell you. Uh then we have a two-way tie for Dream Drop Distance in Birth by Sleep at 8.5. That's fair. And then for Kingdom Hearts 3, uh, we have 8.7. Yeah. And Kingdom Hearts, Kingdom Hearts 1, we have a 9. Yeah. Both those scores are not Kingdom proper. Hearts mm-hmm. 1 got a 9? That Kingdom is Hearts ridiculous. Kingdom Hearts 1 is a 9. That is absolutely fucking atrocious. It's how reviews worked back then. Lower, it's because you're lower. bad yeah. at the game. Was no, he that, bad at the game? No, uh, sure. Yes. yes, I was bad at the game. <laughs> yes, but game's still bad. Fair enough. No, it's a great game. No, definitely not. Uh, well, anyway, this. that is uh, my Nostalgia higher or lower bullshit for Kingdom Hearts Two. IGN, I hate you. Um, <laughs> you you ruined you ruined my life. <laughs> <laughs> IGN ruined my life. <laughs> well, you don't go to uh, them for consistency. Oh no, not really. Uh, please review Yellow Taxi Goes Room, please. Thank you. Um, <laughs> it's over, Phil. <laughs> no, it's sorry, over. man. Uh, moving on. Uh, congratulations, Tavin, first of all. And then Hey-o. also moving on to uh, Connor's mini game. What do you have for us this week, my friend? I got a new game. A, a discussion-based game. game. Uh, I don't know what the name is yet. I called it Smash Bros. Sure. Fuck sure. it. Yeah. Yeah. Why not? Who gives a shit? Uh, Smash Bros. Tavin not, loves not Smashing any, Bros. That's not to you. It's just, I don't, I, it's just, you know, it works. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I'm not good at naming. But anyway, I'm going to bring up characters. And each one of us is going to determine whether they can beat them up in a fight. Now, I'm not talking about a fight with how they come in their games, but fisticuffs, any armor that they might have, you know, they don't have uh, any equipment they don't have. If they're naturally enhanced, just, 
you know, by who they are, that still counts. But right. naturally enhanced, you mean like a like uh, a naturally- cap- like a Captain America Super Soldier Serum? Yeah, yeah, exactly. like Master Chief. He's still yeah, yeah okay, yeah, unarmored, yeah, yeah. but he's he's, he's been Chief. super he's been super sad. He's you know yeah, yeah been tortured. Exactly, <laughs> that's what they would call that. But I'm gonna go ahead and uh, introduce the first character. I have three here. We'll see how long these take. I'm assuming we're not going to be super passionate about fighting. Depending who you grab. It's, yeah. it's, I mean, listen, these are video game characters. They're meant to be powerful. So yeah. uh, it's probably a lot of these is like, man, this motherfucker going to beat the shit out of me. Yes, yes. Uh, hold that thought. Maybe, okay. maybe not. <laughs> the first one is Ratchet from Ratchet and Clank. No, no weapons. weapons? No weapons. Oh, I'm beating the I'm fuck beating out of that shit out of him. <laughs> That's what I was thinking. I'm going to do to him. Like not, like, not even his wrench. No, 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 yeah, I'm beating the shit out of him. Here's uh, yeah, the thing: yeah. we can, we can, we can beat. We can wait. Beat is it yeah. all three of us versus one? No, or? no, no. One, individual. one on one. Yeah. Oh no, wait. That's be unfair. Well, like, well, okay. Hold on, because with wrench, Phil, he is like knocking out a bunch of animals, like a bunch of beasts. With a wrench, he's like beating up robots, abominable right. snowmen. Those are tough. Right. I can't. The snowmen that you showed last week in Know Thy Foe, I can't fight that thing. But Ratchet, no, can. absolutely not. But yeah, can. he does not have wrench, the though. wrench. He doesn't the have wrench. the wrench. Is is it okay? Well, Phil, is it the wrench that is giving him the strength? Exactly to to do that level of damage, or is it his arm? Technically, yes, because in in going commando, you upgrade your wrench two times in that mm-hmm. game, so the wrench is more powerful. Mm-hmm. See, the thing is, I, I was waiting for you guys to talk about it because you've actually played those games. Yeah, even if we were to say, "Oh, he's doing so much because he has the wrench." First Look of all, how tall Ratchet is. Yeah, he's short. He's short. He's that's, only like four foot something. That's the thing. You're able to get him. He doesn't have the reach on you. Yeah. So all you need to do is dodge him, find a, a way to get through, and grab him he by is his five ears. Five feet tall. Five yeah. feet. Damn. Look at him. Okay. Bigger than I thought. Yeah. Bigger than I thought. I, I'm so, going for that tail, man. He's I'm getting also, that tail right off. He has to be lighter I'm, as well. I'm going for the ears. Yes, that's what I was thinking. You dodge his rent, uh, his fists. As powerful as they might be, it doesn't matter. He doesn't have range, I'm, I'm and then you grab him I'm sli- from top. I'm sliding into his kneecaps, right? Sliding into his kneecaps. Hopefully, he doesn't double jump over me. But I'm sliding into these kneecaps, right? No. And then, and then, as soon as he's down, grabbing this, grabbing this fucking tail, and just fucking ripping it right the fuck off. I it's get the tail part. It's interesting that Tavin wants to go lower than somebody that's already shorter than him. That's the problem. He has too much of a, a solid base to work off of compared to you and me. But he's got a good jump. He's got a good jump. Ratchet jumps, man. It shows how yeah, good he so, is. Which, at, which shows that he, yeah. he's dodging he's dodging you by going over you. And he's got like he can keep his feet more planted. So I wanna I wanna bring up Ratchet a is a feet. is a yeah. mechanic. Do you gentlemen feel like you could beat up a real life, real world mechanic? If they is were it, five feet tall, yes. I don't think I because them dudes is lifting heavy tires and lug and twisting lug nuts and shit. See, They're you can't lift a tire? If, I can lift a tire, but like I'm not, I, I'm not easily lifting big tires over my head. A mechanic potentially is. I don't necessarily think so, since they wouldn't have a reason to do so. They I mean, just roll if you were, them, yeah. if we were living in like the 1960s, mechanics that had less of a technological advantage to do their job, they probably could do a lot <laughs> of physical you're, stuff. You're, you're saying the mechanics today, pussy. No, 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 no. That's I'm saying, what you said. I'm I, heard, saying, I heard you say out your be, mouth. I didn't mecha- say that. Modern day mechanics is pussy. You're acting like. They're the opposite of a pussy. I'm saying that's counterbalanced by the fact that they use a lot of equipment nowadays. So they aren't going to be as powerful as you think they are because they're not doing all of the heavy lifting. They're still mechanics, which is a more physical Tavin, job. Tavin, I believe I believe Connor said that mechanics commit mortal sin every day. Yes. Is this end game ratchet or beginning game ratchet? End game ratchet. He's gonna, have a lot, he's gonna have a lot of health. He's gonna have a lot of health. Yeah. He's gonna have a lot of health. You know? He's gonna have eight balls of health as opposed to four. But you get it when he gets hit. He gets stunned, right? He does the oh. He does do a little uh. So, but then here's, he, but then he gets iframes. He does get iframes. That is that does not matter because I'm going he to get iframes like that though. Because he, he hit? G- during the hit animation, yeah. But as soon as he's out the animation, he's he's back. He's back. He, there's no iframes. I, I'm assuming it wouldn't be like a Dark Souls level of invulnerability during those frames where you're invincible. And all you need to do is do what. Uh, uh, What's his, I always get him confused with the author, James Patterson. Yeah, James Patterson. Uh, when he did the the seagull in the lighthouse, he grabbed it by its neck and just like whacked it in between. You think you can? You think you can do that can into a five foot? Yeah, cat man. He is not as heavy as a human being. He's not. 
He is, he, he, he is impossibly not. He looks he looks like a lightweight five okay, person. Okay, okay. Well, here, I'm bringing up something else now. Mm-hmm. Bringing up, he's got he's got teeth. That's why I grabbed can by I, the ears. Can I, can I ask a question? Can I ask a question? Go ahead. Yeah. Connor, why did you bring up James Patterson? <sighs> What's his fucking... No, he's thinking... Uh, I, know, he, I know. He's thinking Robert Patterson. Robert Patterson. Patterson. Yeah. Robert Pattinson. Pattinson. Yeah. Pattinson. They're so similar, you know? Patton. It Patton, is the same whatever. name. It's, it is exactly the same name. Yeah, I was like, James Patterson is a novelist. Yeah, I, I knew I'm going beat, in. Listen, James Patterson beating the fuck out of him. He's, he's too old. He's now. like elderly. Let me see how old is James Patterson. See, exactly beating the shit. See, end game James Patterson getting fucking rocked, bro. But we're talking about end game ratchet. Tab. Yeah, 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 yeah. Please yeah, yeah. stay on top. No armor. He's no armor. Seventy-seven years old. Yeah, that's sorry, guy. I'm, I'm how right. did uh, I'm hitting that guy in the skull and it's going to turn into powder? <laughs> Phil, what did the health system in Going Commando? How did that work? Because it wasn't it was the balls. Nan- nanotech. It wasn't the balls. It was like the, it was oh, like it was the now. yeah, 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 yeah. That's a lot of health. Yeah. Which ratchet are we fighting? <laughs> are we fighting? <laughs> you know, final form well, ratchet, I, whatever that might be. I would, I would presume that it's like rift apart ratchet because, yeah. like, mm. obviously, it's not, it's not us when we were younger fighting the original ratchet. It's us now fighting Ratchet now. <laughs> I'm just saying, I think we would have an easier time fighting fighting uh, Game 1 Ratchet. Of course we would. Oh, it's absolutely true. Yeah. But I, I still think that, like, without all of his stupid armor and without all of his weapons, I still think I'm beating Ratchet. There's a reason why he doesn't rely Does on his Rift strength. Apart, Rift Apart Ratchet have armor? Yes. Okay. I don't remember. Mm-hmm. I, I just remember having the default skin on the whole time. You know, I, I think we, we can obviously bring up points for a while. I'm we probably may not... wrong. I'm probably wrong. Yeah. You probably are. We could... Listen, Rift Apart Ratchet's tough, man. But is he uh, is he that tough without all of his gadgets and weapons and armor and I think, all that I stuff? I think you're overestimating how tough you are. <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm exactly estimating how strong... Uh, what even is he? A marsupial? If he's, he's, uh, of that? he's a lombax. Lombax. Yeah, I guess... I'll call him I, I would say that'd probably fall under the marsupial. Yeah. You know, family. doesn't have a pouch. Oh, uh, you're right. Ah, uh, shit. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. You're right. You're right. Fuck. Well, now my mammal. big question, my big question mammal, yeah. is, is after I mutilate Ratchet, rip off his, rip off his tail, his ears, fucking tail. shove the ears down his gullet. You just beat him uh, in a fist and, fight, and, man. And 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 plug plug out his eyes. You know, I'm fighting to the death, right? No. Oh. To beat him up. Oh. What do you What do you do when you get? Is that when I you was, get into I a fist fight? Far. Is that the idea? When you fight someone with your fist, you're aiming hey, to kill I'm them? If I'm fighting to the death, I'm getting dirty, and you are losing well, appendages. Of course, of course. Yeah, you go for the eyes each time. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. yeah. We're not savages here. Oh, okay. You're going to okay, kill okay. Ratchet, the hero? Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. What do you, if I need to. You don't need to. If it's me, if it's me or him, it's got to be him. You well, know? it's a good That's thing it's saying. not a matter of yeah. you and him. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah, okay, okay, okay. All right, well, this, yeah, this does change things. You know what? Honestly, now that it's not a fight to the death, I think my, my, my odds actually improve. Really? Yeah. Oh, the teeth is what you were. I was worried about them of, teeth. Yeah. I was worried about them teeth. But if we're like, if you know, if we're fighting with with some, you know, quality, he can bite a, you. We're being men of honor. No, he can still bite I mean, you. Why would he bite me? Because it's uh, you use everything you have at your disposal. Well, here's the thing: if it's, a, if it's just a if it's just a fight, man, I, I feel like going for the ears and the tail is cheap. I'm still gonna do it. Oh, okay, okay, all right. Well, we're Listen, fighting yeah. dirty. We're, all, we're fighting, all of but we're these fighting things dirty. are like based off an honor system that doesn't actually exist. If you're right. so we, in a situation, we all think we're gonna beat Ratchet, right? Yeah, I I think we can you know, uh, you know, go all over the place here. He but do, I think it's different. But but when I beat him, does he do the little dance, <laughs> the, uh, his little death <laughs> no. animation dance, he did, like the little spin and fall over? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, he's knocked out. He's knocked okay. out. All right, who's next? Next, moving on. M- moving on. It is going to be Gordon Freeman. Now. Doesn't have his armor. Doesn't have his crowbar. He's like picking up crates, man. With the armor, and he's on. like throwing with, them around. With, oh, with the right. armor, but he's, right. picking, he's picking up crates with the gravity gun. Is what he's with the gravity doing. gun as well. See, he has a lot of feats. None of them are really all that physical. But he is a grown man. We're not dealing with a yeah. you know five foot lombax. No, nah, well, I mean, I mean, but like Gordon Freeman, just like a little scientist dude. So yeah, know, this who is a pencil is, pusher. I think I think Gordon Freeman versus Ratchet. Ratchet comes out on top. I don't think so. I'm. I think I'd lose to Gordon. I think we underestimate him. Oh, uh, Gordon but he's, Freeman is six three. Yeah, he's. Oof. Yeah, he's winning. Yeah. Uh, the thing about him is that even if he's not a main physical fighter, he's been through enough punishment to be able to take more hits than you probably would. Me as well. And he had to pick Again, stuff up because along of, the way. That's that because of battle armor, though. But he. I mean, you know, it's only going to impact. It's only going to like. I guess you're right. By the end of so like much. By the end of like Half Life Two, Episode Two, he's like. 
he's like a war hero. <laughs> yeah. So it's like he's got to have picked up something to be able to take you out, you know, even without the crowbar or yeah, the I'm armor. Pretty sure, pretty sure I'm losing. And the height thing, as you said, I think that kind of seals the deal. I think he just. But it's the. But like, again, this is a scientist. I know, yeah. Without his power armor, without his cross, crowbar, without his weapons, he fights with weapons. Weapons and armor is the name of the game for Gordon Freeman. Right? He does. Like you, other than that, you can't do anything in that game. Mm-hmm. You got a you got a halfway decent jump, and you can pick up trash and put it in a trash can. You know? Yeah. He did pick up somebody else's trash. Like he gets intimidated from like the little like because like come on like the guards in that game the little you know white mask blue suit guys you know uh, those guys are fucking pussies right? You know. Now that I think about it, Alex in Half Life Two was able to beat up multiple members of that unit, and he couldn't even do anything. He got knocked out. Yeah. Well, Alex is a badass. I'm losing to Alex for sure. Oh well, yeah, of course. But I'm just saying, at that point, if you know, you can't this, do anything. But this fucking pencil pusher. He just gets uh, he gets knocked out like immediately, basically. Yeah. I'm he taking this hit. pencil pusher uh, out, yeah, bro. Then, then yeah, maybe 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 I can be Gordon Freeman. I'm taking I'm taking uh, this, uh, this fucking nerd. I'm taking him out. I think there's too many unknown variables, especially when you're talking about intelligence. He might know where to hit me, you know, to make it really, really hurt or destabilize me. Like fucking Sherlock Holmes. Yeah. Uh, he's a physicist. He's not a biologist. You pick up stuff. Yeah, he's, science he's gonna, science. He's going to discombobulate me, dude. Yeah. I think he's beating me. I'll be humble enough to admit that. Yeah. I, know, think Ratchet, Connor, right? I think Ratchet's I think, a I think tougher I target here, guys. I Genuinely, I think Ratchet's a tougher target. No, I, I don't see I, that. I, I'm I'm beating that little that little <laughs> ratchet's agile. Boy. He's I think he's more durable. Because again, when the armor's gone, your health goes like that. If anybody's played a Half Life game, you know you got to keep that armor up because the health goes fast. But he's a normal person. We're normal people. But he's taller and he's been through the ringer more. I just think that and he's smarter objectively. This this, co- this to me really comes down to: Do you think you could? I I think I could take one of the one of the guards in Half Life. I think I could take one of those guys. Gordon can't. That's the thing. He was getting chased by multiple, admittedly. He just didn't do anything to even one of them. Yes, but there are points in the game where clearly these guys have physical dominance over him, if not for the fucking weapons. That is true. You know? I think I could take one of those guys, and I Mm -hmm. think I could take Freeman. I feel like when the goal is just a don't think height. I don't think height's going to matter that much. Maybe not too too much. You close his distance. You get in, you get into his gut. You're fucking hitting him hitting him in the gut a bunch of times. You're good. Get him I like just, a little tack. Get him a little like a little tackle. And just hit him. Bah, bah. I just feel like he won't be cowed in a like proper fight setting as opposed to being chased by effectively Nazis. So again, I, I think that's a fear. I element. feel like I could take those Nazis. I feel like I could, but I think when you give him confidence and he's not like needing to run away. He knows, I oh, I need he, to find I don't think he's up. got it, it, man. I don't think he's got it. Well, you can find out when you meet him one day. <laughs> I'll still say, I'll give him, I'll give him And also, if this, is, if this is a round-based fight, if we in the octagon, he's not showing up for the third round. You don't think so, huh? It's a Half-Life 3 joke. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> maybe. Maybe, that, maybe that does seal the fact that he would lose. Who knows? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well... I, I have the one main more. Main re- reason of the issue is that is that you're not making it out of the first round, Tavin. Ooh, that's true. No, I think no, I think I'm I think I'm fucking in, I think mm-hmm. I'm fucking this little pencil pusher. I mean, like even as a man with glasses, even his glasses, the glasses he chooses to wear tell me pussy. You know. Mm, you fair know? enough. That's a, that's an element I there, can't. There touch. are tough guy glasses and there are pussy glasses. Now I'm not saying I have tough guy glasses, but I definitely don't have pussy glasses. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Are the round ones tough? Yeah. Yeah. No. No, no, they're not tough. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay, I'll concede. But he's got that. he's got the thick, like rectangular all the way around ones, and those are for fucking nerds. Okay, I can believe that. But Phil, what'd you say? You said you're still beating him. No, I said I'm losing. Losing. Okay. Well, Tevin thinks he can. Ratchet. Ratchet is tougher. No, you guys are not giving enough credit to Ratchet. You're putting all this on height, and height's not the only factor. And the, the fact that he has easy to take advantage of appendages. It's true. That is, that is true. Sir, I'm good in the chat picking up what I'm putting <laughs> down. <laughs> of course you're doing that. Well, I think we're good for now. You're going to stop there? Yeah, I think so. Really? Just, just out of curiosity, who's the third, one? the third one? Well, the third one, uh, I can't remember off the top of my head, is Chell from ha- uh, from Portal. Oh, no, you Chell's know? fucking me up. Really? Yeah, I think I'm- She's got her legs? No. 
Well, oh, wait, she's legless. She, is she? Does she actually have? She's got robot legs. Oh, so she's got she's got ro- robot enhanced legs. Yeah, she uh, still has regular yes. human legs. And she's, the, got, she's got like weird braces on her legs. Yeah. Yeah. She, she's like got off. like she's got like uh, she's got like scoops for feet. It, it, they're like scoops on like attached to the back of her they're, like shoes. They're, they're boots. braces, is what they are. All right. Yeah. Show me a picture of show right now. That's what I'm doing. Uh, I think I'm winning mainly because even though she's you know mentally stronger, intelligence wise, it's based off the player. Which if I'm fighting her, it's but those in- like those lasers that she just fucking takes. That is true. You know. Okay. So, but she does. Okay, you're right. So, but she doesn't have these. No, she does not. No? But those lasers she takes, man. Well, I'm not taking. Them, yeah. I'm not eating those lasers. You, you know, cave she, in. Yeah, she takes those lasers. You know, She's also not for got, like, not for super long, but she damage. takes them. And I, and I think for that, wait, what's that? She also has like major brain damage. She she can't speak. <laughs> oh, that doesn't matter. What? That, that, that gives her strength. In a sense, it does matter. Exactly. Because, exactly. That's what I'm saying. I'm losing. Yeah. <laughs> uh, well, hold on for a second. Her intelligence, brain damage or no, is entirely based off of the player. And so, if you're fighting her, it's how you perceive her, which is going to be as smart as you. So, so because wait, 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 wait. So, because you're bad at Portal, you think she's an idiot. That's the thing. She's not going to be super intelligent. And so, all we're left on is Connor you... losing. Connor's winning. <laughs> Connor's yes. winning. Yeah, because <laughs> you bring up the lasers. That's true. She's more. She's, she's, she's eating able to take, those lasers. She's deep. able to take more punishment, but. I don't think strength I think wise. that alone is going to give it to her, man. I, I think that makes her hold out really long, but I don't think she still has I, it in the I strength department. I, I, think, I think she's got more endurance than you. I think she's tougher than you. And, and a general you, like all of us. Yeah. I think she's got more endurance. She's tougher. And, I, and you know, she's like picking – she's picking stuff up. Like, not big things, but I imagine some of these things are pretty heavy. And, you know, she's picking shit up. I think anything she picks up in those games, I could pick up as well. I think my physical strength will override her I think, endurance. I think, I think as well, like the but, turrets, I think mm-hmm. the turrets are the, dense. Those turrets that she picks remember, up are probably pretty dense. The only thing she's actually holding in that game is the portal gun. Everything else is like is like a little beam that she's holding stuff with. She's not actually holding anything true? I don't know mm-hmm. other than the portal, portal gun. I think it's just because they're just not animating the arms. But I've always, I've always thought you're picking things up with the arms. I mean, it's kind of hard oh, to hold because, the gun and hold things yeah, at the same no, time. Because you can see, like, whenever you pick something up, you can see, like, a little... It's not, It's not like... There's some kind of, like, frame that where, like, the, the gun kind of, like, holds it for, for, for them, for the, the, the block. I think, it's, I think it's just being held up by nothing. Well, it's, it's the gun, though, is what I'm saying. I, you, regardless, I don't think she's really using supernatural strength to pick up anything in that game. Uh, it, regardless, though, she's fit. She is fit. She's fit. That's true. Shell's and whooping my ass. She'll make us fit into a coffin. I'm saying. Yeah, Shell is whooping my fit ass. Fit is different from being able to physically fight. It's different. Okay, but again, she's not going to feel our punches. She's not going to feel them. It'll happen. If, you can only take so much. She doesn't take unlimited okay, lasers. Okay, but Connor, you Connor, Connor, you agree that like these lasers are slicing you in half immediately. Like, yeah. you, like, like it's a lightsaber going through you, and she's eating it. Yeah. She's just going, ow, ow. Like, she that's also, all she's doing. Yeah. She also takes bullets. Yeah, yeah. I'm she still, eats bullets. She eats I, lasers. I, I don't. If she was like super physically imposing or stronger, yes, I think that would overall beat me. But I think that'll only go so far. She only has a there's set no health, way. Only there's set no way you're saying you're gonna lose to Gordon Freeman. Yeah. But but beat Shell. Yeah. There's no way. Yeah. No way. I think so. Yeah. No. Yeah. I'm gonna do it, Phil. I'm gonna I'm gonna pull the card. I'm gonna pull the card. You're a sexist. Yeah, go it's for because it. she's I'm, a woman. Uh, sexist or not, I'm still beating her. You're not beating. Her. I still am. You're absolutely it makes not. This is an insane. It does not matter. This is an insane take. This is an absolutely it's, it's wild 20, take. Hey, listen, Gordon Freeman. He's been through way more tense situations than she has. He's taken bullets too. And we're going to that conte- uh, into that context. He's been shot. He dies quick, but so does he. Dies so does way quicker than she does. I don't think that's necessarily no true. way I think, quicker. I think that is true. Yeah. No, he. Yeah, no armor. You're dying fast as fuck in Half Life. I don't think that much. No, faster. you die fast. <laughs> yeah, honestly, the health is probably the same, seeing as they're from the same game and the same, same developer engine. and the yeah, same yeah. like box. It's probably. I, the I'm same telling you, system. man, Shell's dangerous, bro. She's dangerous. Uh, she, you, she jumps. I understand her legs are enhanced, but I still think she can jump and handle fall damage way better than Freeman can. And those lasers cutting Freeman up, cutting Freeman up. Well, Freeman's taking lasers. He's getting be a power <laughs> armor. <laughs> Well, you're gonna you get your help, wonder. your armor down. She's and then in a you tank top and some prison pants. Yeah, yeah, but I you still, get the armor taken down, and what's the difference? I still, I still think that I'm, I'm losing, losing to Chell, but, um, 
like you got to think she she's like fresh I, I assume fresh shot like we just took like the braces off her legs right like she's still getting used to walking around yeah like she's like she's well, a baby deer walking around you know let's be let's be reasonable and say let's not fight somebody who can barely walk so she'd recover if can she, she had not some walk well i feel like her limbs would atrophy to some degree oh, if for she's sure, relying because on there, she's she's mostly using the bra the braces she, like is when, she you're so used to something like that see this is well, the thing is there's not a lot of lore in these games like there's not a lot of you, you gotta think you gotta think whenever whenever you're um well because she's fresh from a coma in the second game so like her limbs are definitely atrophied um that's just because uh, um that's just because uh uh the uh aperture puts her to sleep yeah, but that still make your uh, legs it still go away. Makes your limbs atrophy. Yeah, you, you honestly, um, I think that happens in like a week in the hospital. Like if, but, if you're uh, like really yeah, just sad. Like but, but again, we're doing in game. Like, you guys ever, you guys ever been in, inside true. of a bounce house or been been on a trampoline? Yes. I mean, if we're doing in game, like, though, she like her legs are up at the end you know, of game. Like, you know, you know, like uh, whenever you, you're fret, like you, you stop bouncing on the trampoline and you 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 you, you stop all that like you stop doing all it's that little, yep like as soon as you start walking on a regular plane oh, yeah, again yeah, you yeah. feel way weaker like it's just it's just really really weird that's how it'll be for her i i just don't think we should have that standard like, like i wouldn't fight someone who could barely walk due to atrophied legs we'd let i'd let him recover and then well, the fight means, can happen then that means that you're not winning because you're just not gonna fight her i'm sorry you're no, not fighting later you're I'll not winning, later period. Later there's no whatever you want to put on it there's no winning against chow I, I I think I can zero chance. She doesn't even pick up the boxes as we said before. Her limbs I think, I aren't. Think, super I think that's strong. up for interpretation. I think fresh. I think fresh off off the off the the braces. I can take her, but uh, but if if we're talking, give, like, give her twenty four hours and I'm fucked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say if she's recovered, then yeah, I'm I'm, I'm losing. Stipulation I, there. I think I'm fucked no matter what. I I, I think y'all are reaching with the atrophy thing. I'm gonna. I, I'm not. I'm not relying I, I, on. I honestly. It. Don't I'm just think saying. So I think, I'm just I think saying. Her limbs are atrophied as fuck. And I'm just saying that they would be atrophied. I wouldn't say I'd fight her with atrophied limbs. These are not the characters I thought you were going to pull, but granted, there's a lot of video game characters that'd be like, oh, Donkey Kong. Yeah, he's going to rip me apart. Like, ah, what, what are we talking going? about? I can go fight a gorilla right now and show I'm, you how I'm that would losing go. The, I'm losing the Diddy, bro. Yeah. yeah. Diddy got a no, vicious tail. No, that ta no, no, no. That tail? That tail on Diddy is dangerous. He's a monkey. He's not a gorilla or a chimp. But he's got... Yeah. Yep. Fucking dog is getting real antsy. She's able to run when I'm chasing her in the house for play purposes and dodge through like chairs and whatnot with no problem. Yeah. And then she can't do that. She's not paying attention. Mm -hmm. She's wagging her tail. You know, when she's running, anyway. she's not wagging her tail. She just went to your Moving room and on. came back out. So Connor, I don't know what that means. You're crazy. Uh, Tavin, what do you have for us this week, my friend? Uh, gentlemen, I've got another edition of I Spy UI. Let me take my quick time code real quick. Boop, boop, boop. Do, 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 do. There we go. All right. So I am going to move over here. And I'm going to open up. Tavin, what, what's I Spy UI? I Spy UI is, of course, I've gone around the different games, and I have photoshopped out all of the UI elements um, of those games. I need to move this. Sorry, I'm dealing with a lot. I thought this was going to be smooth. It's not smooth. That's the wrong tab. Or he's dealing with not enough. There we go. I Spy UI. I Spy UI. There we go. So I photoshopped out the different... Uh, UI elements of five different games. I'm going to show you those elements. Some of these games, I've moved the elements around to make it a little bit more difficult. Some of them, I've kept them in their original place just because, you know, it might it might just be difficult enough. Also, I don't know how much you guys have played each one of these individual games. So, some of them may be harder or easier depending on what it is. Of course, we are going to go off of an honor, honor system like we always do. So, you gentlemen are going to, you know, just whenever you're locked in, ready up. You're going to say, hey, I'm ready. I'm locked in. Something like that. And then you're going to tell me what that game is is Kevin, can, can you can you change your screen share to that oh please? my apologies that's the oh, that's the god. element i was oh, missing god oh god ba, 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 ba. No, uh, this hey one. i'm gonna find out what you did in my room thank you <laughs> here you'll hear me yell so gentlemen here we go with our first are we ready the i am ready the thing is you, you can't you can't you can't get mad at her for whatever you did it has to be right after she has to thing. be right after you, you can't do it you know you can't mm -hmm. do it you know that's what's that's what's unfortunate here we go stupid uh Game number one. Oh. Connor feels oh, like he's on. got it. Connor feels like he's got it. Phil, how are you feeling? 
This isn't fair, dude. It's not. Because, <laughs> like, I know the series. Oh, uh, you do got to give oh, me the game. Oh, I know, I know what it is. I'm, I'm, should, I'm should be in. pretty easy if you know the series. You should know. Yeah, I'm locked Wait, in. Which which one it is? Uh, Phil, go ahead. Persona Five. Persona Five. It is in fact. Persona 5. I was waiting for you to be like, nope, it's Persona 5 Royal. No, I'm not. No, I'm the, it's the same UI. Yeah. You know, that's yeah, the same because, thing. Because I, I was like, oh, man, I know it's Persona, but then I saw, like, the ammo, and I was like, oh, yeah. It's definitely the, the, the gun, hit, the weak the thing. That, that definitely gave it away right there. But I, I don't know how easy it would have been without it because you need that red. You yeah. know, that red is what really gives... Mm -hmm. You let you know it is i tried to switch it up me. trying to put the you know the ammo counter somewhere else to make it look like a like a different game or something like that mm -hmm. uh you know just try and mix it up a little bit so yeah that is game number one congratulations gentlemen tie game so far game number two Ooh. maybe a little bit Ooh. trickier I'm, I'm i'm locked in both of you have played this video game I'm, I'm locked in immediately i am as well but i you know i don't think connor you may have honestly played more of it than phil if I if I oh, think so, he has he has yeah oh yeah, yeah. Connor maybe I'm wrong then uh Splitgate Phil no this is Star Wars Battlefront two this is in fact Star Wars Battlefront two yeah, yeah 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 didn't move anything here didn't move anything because I didn't know how I, how recognizable this would be for you for you gentlemen I definitely I don't remember Splitgate more. having a lot of UI elements Battlefront two no, definitely really a lot of UI elements uh for game number three. Oh, this isn't fair. <laughs> Kevin, this is not fair. Oh, I, I should know it. I, of course I know what it is. I, I tried to, I see, I switched out. I'll be honest, Connor. I switched, I moved pieces around in the hopes that it would throw Phil off the scent. Not uh, at all. Did not. It, it did not at all. He, yeah, it seems he knows exactly what it is. Um, yeah. I'm probably oh, not yeah. winning this. For, one. In the sake, in the sake of fairness, I'm gonna give you a quick hint. Wait, wait. I, I no, 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 no. Adore this game. Unicorn Overlord. It is Unicorn Overlord. It is in fact Unicorn Overlord. For the for the record, I was guessing that before you said the hint, but thank you for that. Yeah, 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 yeah. you did. You had your oh moment. The yes. light bulb went off right before. Congratulations. Uh, Phil up one, but Connor, you're not letting him run away with it. No. So good job. Moving on. No, 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 no. To game number four. Here we go. Four of five, gentlemen. You've both played this game. And I'm literally blanking on it. I shouldn't be. You shouldn't be. No, I know what it is. Something, uh, mm. look, at, look at some of these elements. Look at some of these images. I know, and one of them's like, that's what I'm saying. I'm like, it has, yeah, I know what it is. Connor's locking in. Yeah. Yeah, one I'm locking in. Give that away. Okay. Uh, Phil. Uh, I'm going to say Fable. Connor. Ooh, that might be fable. Uh, Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Nope, you're both you're both fucking failures. This is Horizon Zero Dawn. Fuck Horizon. Yeah, dude, I barely played Horizon. Yeah, but you've played it. <laughs> you've played it. Look, the the little horse the icon, the all of that, the the different the different things going on, the health bar. That's what was throwing me off. Very much Horizon. I would have gotten that one immediately. Mm -hmm. Immediately, I would have gotten that one. Game five, final game. Oh, Phil is up one. Connor, can you can you can you stage a little bit of a tie game? I was really hoping you were gonna get that Horizon one. I hope you so know? as well. I wish so as well. You know, I don't. Oh, know what hang this on. Is. I know what series this is. Oh, I know it. I'm check the in. check the mission, Connor. Check. I know the that's why I'm like, what is the what is the mission objective there? I left the mission objective left on the uh, on the UI. I did not move any AI elements. I just enlarged them. Mm -hmm. You know. Just made them a little bit bigger. Out for the count. Seems like boxing of some sort, but it's yeah, I'm it's locked. What boxing in. game it is. Hmm. I think I lose these in this game. Uh, um, it's what the bar at the top's throwing me off. What is that shit? It looks like what is it? Yeah, what does it look like? I know Connor? what it is. What does it look like? It's a charge thing. Oh. Oh, uh, okay. What is it? Uh, that is going to be. L I'm locked in. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's Lego Star Wars. It's, do you want to be a little? Do you want to be the, uh, the? Do you want to uh, be a? Hold on! Hold on! Hold on! Hold on! Hold on! Do you want to be a little more specific? Lego Star Wars. Uh, it's it's the complete edition thing, but it's called Lego Star Wars. Not anniversary. It's 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 something related to the movies. Uh huh. Like tr not what, what do they call that? It's not uh -huh. called a trilogy. It's not prequel. It's the one. It's the one. Uh, uh, it, it. Come on, you can get there. Lego. With all of it. Star Wars. With all of it. 
Is it the whole fucking... Okay, it's, no. It's all of it. Can you get there? The complete collection? Yeah, can you... Uh, Phil? Lego Star Wars The Skywalker Saga. It Skywalker is, in fact, saga, the Skywalker yeah. Saga. Yeah, there we go. Right there. Even See, though it's not down, really... Out for the count? He's fighting Count Dooku. Count Dooku. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Those are the little, the little like, mini bits that you collect. Even though it's not really the Skywalker Saga. The studs. 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 It is the Skywalker Saga. Right. Nah, it has the sequels. Those aren't the Those Skywalker, are Skywalker movies. Too. Why is it? Say it. Don't. Well, Luke Skywalker's in them. He's only in one of them. <laughs> he's in. He's in all three of them. Of he's the actually sequels? in all yes. three of them. Yep. When's he's he coming in, in the first one? At the very end. Very end. Literally the, last minute. Those and are half. such nothing movies. Okay, you win. No, that no. Nah, episode seven's a lot of fun. No, it's not that great. Episode eight has a lot in it. I, I agree with Connor. It's not that great, but it's good. No, seven. Seven is one of the best Star Wars movies. I thought you said eight was the better one. No. No? No. You're not in that camp. Huh? I might like 8 more just because 8 has more to say, mm. but 7 is objectively a way better movie than 8. Mm. I would I would agree 9 with you, is a fucking but, trash fire of a film. <laughs> none none of those none of those movies are are great. No, 7's great. No. Nah. A, a, am I going like greatest of all time films? No, but 7's great. Yeah. You literally just said it was one of the best Star Wars movies. Yeah, I think I think there's two Star Wars movies that are greatest of all time worthy. Five and four. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Kevin's actually pretty reasonable with his uh Star Wars criticism or right, analysis. Like I don't I just don't agree that seven is in the same caliber. Sure. Seven is not in the same caliber as four and five now. But it's still one of the greatest Star Wars movies, and I would still say it's a great movie. I'm watching I'm watching th I'm picking up three before I watch seven. That's that's fucking ludicrous. Oh, I would do that in an instant that as is, well. No, you guys are letting no. nostalgia take over. No, those movies are just more fun. No, they're not. They're objectively more I fun. I promise you they're not. I can guarantee you they are more. Yeah, you want to go down there? You want to go down this fucking road with me? No, because I'm not going to watch them. <laughs> exactly. Let's watch them I'm all. not going to watch either of them. Let's watch them all. <laughs> Let's watch them all right fucking now. Tell me you don't have more fun with seven than you do with, than you do with these fucking god-awful prequel movies. Way more fun with three. Prequels are fucking boring as shit. They're not that bad. I don't think you three, remember how much. Not cause, great. Because the no, first, not good. The, the first, the first two are fucking god awful. Yeah. The third one is fun. They're not, but not like that the, the, bad. The only thing that's fun about three is the, the 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 starship cruiser bit, the opening bit. As soon as they get out of the ships, it's dumb prequel shit again. See, the problem, and then and then and then there is two hours of movie where nothing happens, and then there's a fun lightsaber duel at the end. And then you're pissed off that that Padme dies for no reason. The problem is that these criticisms all valid, but it's on the backdrop of comparing it to Seven, which is boring all the way through. No, Seven is a lot of fun. Seven's got a lot of momentum. Character motivations make sense. Acting in Seven is is great. Acting is great. Lighting is great. Connor, the movie looks Connor, beautiful. Connor, let me ask you a question. What what movie is this fight from? Oh, with this fight right here? This should be easy. Yeah. The third. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> wait, wait, did, yeah. You, did, you look, did you look at where it says episode three at the top? No, I did not. The yeah. only time they fought other than this is in I mean, they only two. fight. Yeah, they fight Dooku twice. And he gets yeah. his ass kicked in two. Yeah. And it's not in the, uh, and it, the start. Well, Pal Palpatine the is there. Wars, they fight him more times. They what? do fight, oh, they fight they him do. a lot in Clone Wars. They, they do, do fight him a lot in Clone Wars. You know? They have to. Fun fact. This is like this is like uh, uh, when Home Dude and Lord of the Rings kicks the helmet type fact, uh, but the, to where like you always have to say it, yeah. and everybody knows it. But in uh, the Clone Wars, because of one single line in Revenge of the Sith, uh, the entire duration of all seven uh, seasons of the Clone Wars, Anakin Skywalker and George uh, George uh, General Grievous uh, don't meet. Really? Yeah, because they because there is a line that pretty much confirms that uh, in Episode Three is the first time they meet. So Clone Wars throughout that all, and Grievous mm -hmm. is a heavy part of that show. He's, yeah, I know. He's, he's, he's in that show more than Dooku is, mm -hmm. you know? So. As he should be. He needs more work done. Yeah, sure. Yeah. yeah, you know. So, anyways. Perfect addition to my collection. Yeah, there you go. Now did, you're, you're keeping track did now. Did the dog bump the main camera? She might have. It looks like she must have, because it's... Yeah, it's, everything's out of whack. Well, it's, it's, switch the screen, I can tell you. Well, I don't have to switch the screen to, mm -hmm. for you to tell you. You just you can but see. But I want to see it. I want to see it. It's, it's slightly askew, which means it uh, had to have been knocked away. Anyway, let's go ahead and start wrapping it up here. Uh, congratulations to me. I won. Um, 
this episode of uh, I Spy UI. Uh, and, you know, and this is a, a great time playing some mini games with my friends. It's def- I think it definitely yeah, got, got bumped. Um, and, you know, let me know in, in the comments what your favorite Kingdom Hearts game is and, and how none of them are better than two. Um, let me know what character you can beat in the fight of what we said and how crazy Connor is for thinking he can beat Chell. Sticking by. Um, him. Uh, and then <clears throat> what's crazy is you, is you add on the fact that you give, you give her the refractory period of, of like getting re- recovered. Guys, you can't, that's, that's, you can't beat Chell. That's what I'm saying. Not He's saying the that. only way I'm beating, the only way I'm beating her is, is if I get her right off of her, off her, uh, I thought she had robot out. legs. <laughs> no. <laughs> If like I knew they were, I knew they down. like I knew about the scoop, so I thought they were like, like the the skinny robot legs, but just yeah. like a big scoop. Uh, I don't yeah. know how I else thought, to say that. If if she had robot legs, then there's no chance I win. Zero chance. Um, yeah, she'd be able to do whatever. She'll fucking kick you, and you'll get launched across the room, yeah. splatter yeah, against yeah, the yeah. wall. Exactly. Exactly. Awesome, like and invincible then, uh, shit. Let, let me know. Let me know. Uh, what What's your favorite games UI? What's the most iconic looking UI in games? Uh, and also like how. How rude that was of, of Tavin to include Unicorn Overlord and Connor didn't get it until the end. I really, th- I, I was really hoping that maybe I could because I put it after Battlefront, so I was hoping maybe your brain was going to be in multiplayer realm. <laughs> yeah. Not, it's not so. Nah, not a chance. Not a chance. Uh, but yeah, uh, boys, thank you for joining me, and uh, let's say goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye.